Hey y'all, it's me, back with another video. Okay, so, um, I really don't like this camera angle, but we're going to deal with it. So, today I'm doing something that is a little different. I don't think there's going to be a live today, because I don't really feel like talking, like, um, all that. But I want to show you guys this wig, um that I ordered and I think the name of this is the wrap wig or something like that I'm not even I, I'll probably put the the name of the company in the description box but I think this was called the wrap wig or something so it is a small wig attached to a head wrap um situation when i saw it on the model it was really cute and i was thinking oh yes i should be able to put that over you know put my try to put my dreads in like a flat bun and put this over my dreads to do something different. I don't know why I thought that. Because it, this is it. Like, it's not deep at all. And I'm really thinking, like, if you're a big-headed person like I am, like, I really have a nice uh, size head. There's a whole lot of brain and knowledge and books and all kind of stuff in there. And if you're anything like me, this is not going to work for you. There's no comb or anything to attach this to your head there's nothing but this little string I guess that you're supposed to pull and it's supposed to um I don't know what the string is supposed to do but with shipping and everything this thing was $42 $42 now when I cut my hair, which is probably going to be soon, that's why I'm not really tripping off of it. When I cut my hair, it may work. I mean, I'm pretty sure like you can stick some bobby pins down in here if you are afraid. I don't know, because this this cap thing it's it's woven really tight and I don't even know if a bobby pin will like go through here I don't know you may be able to get a bobby pin through here and get it to stay on your head some kind of way but I don't know how like there's no comb there's nothing like I was at least expecting it to be a comb on the inside or something to attach it to your because like i'm having this feeling that if a nice you know wind comes by it's gonna take your cute little curly wig i mean they had different colors it's really cute on okay so maybe if i don't have any hair it may stay but Since I do have hair, they might stay. I don't know. But I, you know, I would probably constantly be pulling it, you know, like tugging at the little, um, it is a really cute wig. It's really cute. It, it's, I don't, it's a little imbalanced, like it's a little, it seems like it's fuller on the sides than it is in the back. The back don't really seem um, as full as the sides, but it's 
extremely soft. I don't think that this is human hair. It's very soft and it's so cute, but the way my head, hair situation is set up, I don't even know why I thought that I would be able to get all of these dreads up under this wig, but I really did. I don't know why my face looks so shiny, but I have a ring light, so that could be um, part of it. And I'm not matching at all. I got on this green shirt and these red. In okay, but I got, I digress. Oh, the thing shedding. Is it shedding, Jesus? Yeah. It's cute. And I do like myself with, um, I used to be blonde. Like my dreads used to be blonde. So I really do like myself with, um, lighter hair. And I've always liked the kinky curl. I mean, it's, look at that. It's all bouncy and everything. Like, it's the cutest little thing. And I'm thinking, like, do I, you know, do I just want to, like, cut my hair off and just, you know, buy a couple of these little wig situation things? But the way my hot flashes is, is set up, I don't know. But, like, if I'm bald and I have this, on my head I shouldn't be having as many hot flashes right like I don't know y'all that's my concern with wigs is I'm gonna put this on and be sweating like crazy because my hot flashes is are going to go into overdrive like I should have put my little makeup on and um you know what i might just do my dreads like this in the back so you can't see them and put my um like put them in a ponytail in the back so you can't see them <laughs> and do my makeup and wear my little wig in these videos y'all bet not say nothing you better not be like, oh my God, we can see your dreads in the back. Stop looking, okay? Because I want to wear my wig. I think it's so cute. I mean, I, I probably would be constantly pulling it down. But I think it's cute. I don't know. Y'all like it? Y'all think it's cute? I think it's cute. It did come in different colors. It I I even saw one I think that was had gray in it. Um they had kinkier ones. They had all different kinds. Now, oh. So, I went to their website on Instagram, well, the Instagram page or whatever child. And so people were asking, like, is the wig full or whatever? So, you know, I had, like, commented about, yeah, it's full, but don't have no big head because it's probably not going to fit you. And, you know, the people got mad at me, girl, deleted my comment and everything. And I'm like, what? why? Why? I'm telling the truth. If you have a big head, it's probably not going to fit. Or, I don't know, girl. I'm going to leave the information about this wig in the description. And one other thing that I didn't like is it just came in a Ziploc bag. Like, they didn't give you no um, care instructions, the color, whether it's human hair or synthetic. I'm assuming it's synthetic. I really am. I don't think this is human hair. It's really soft, though, for it's synthetic. I don't know what it is. I haven't, um, I've been out of the, you know, fake hair game for 16 years. So, I don't know. It could be a mixture of, I don't know, child. I don't know what y'all be doing now. But the only thing I did, okay, see, I'm starting to get hot in this thing. Been only been on my head for like five minutes. Um, I'm not sure if it's human hair or what. I didn't like that it just came in a Ziploc bag. There was no instructions, no details, no 
thank you from the company for, for purchasing from us or nothing. When people buy things from me, I send them a handwritten note. I know they got a kajillion customers, but you can, you know, you can add something. You could have sent me some eyelashes with the wig or something. Something. Okay, yeah, I'm getting hot for real now. Okay, y'all, I'm finna go. Take. Let me take this thing off. Oh. <laughs> Before I be done fell out in this house in this dang on wig. Okay, y'all. Um, where we at? Oh, we had 10 minutes. I'm gonna talk about this wig for 10 minutes. I will see y'all later. I love you. Bye.